So the way neuromuscular electrical stimulation works is a patient will come into the clinic um, and we'll assess their swallowing um, and get case, a case history um, to determine what the cause of uh, the dysphagia, the swallowing difficulty um, is. Um, once we determine that Vital Stim Plus, the device is suitable for them, uh, we will select the muscles, the swallowing muscles, it could be on the face, targeting the facial nerve, or it could be anywhere on the neck or under the chin. Um, we'll put electrodes on the muscles, um, and then we'll do a number of different exercises, and we'll also do some, some eating and some drinking. And what the electrodes do is they provide an electrical current to the swallowing muscles. So every time those muscles contract, um, you know, if you think of it like the gym, uh, you know, going for a walk versus going on a treadmill or lifting weights. So the muscles need to be moving and as they're moving, the electrical stimulation makes them contract a million times harder and makes the muscles work a lot harder so they get stronger stronger and more coordinated. Um, and so we'll go through different exercises, we'll go through eating and drinking depending on what the client's needs are. Um, and then what they'll find is those muscles will gradually get stronger and stronger and they won't need to swallow um, and, and it won't be as effortful. Um, now ideally, if you think of it, I like to compare it as going to the gym. If you go to the gym one day a week, um, you'll get some nice results, but you're not going to get huge results very quickly. Um, so you do need to have that regular um, uh, attendance, regular sessions, three, four, five times a week um, for a few weeks. Um, so in the past, I've done five days a week for three weeks um, in intensive, and what you find is uh, you get some fantastic results, um, and then they can come back two or three times a week, depending on what their diagnosis is and, and what their difficulties are. Um, and so what they find over time is those muscles get a lot stronger. Now I've seen clients in the past um, with cerebral palsy and brain injuries. I've seen young children who've come in and they've never um, been able to eat or drink um, orally. It's always been through a tube, um, whether that be uh, a nasogastric tube through their nose or a, a peg tube which goes straight into their stomach. And I've uh, seen clients and I've weaned them off these tubes um, using Vital Stim, um, this electrical stimulation. So it is an amazing uh, therapy approach um, and it's the most advanced technology for dysphagia that I believe um, and I think for a lot of clients when they've tried everything they've tried the traditional therapy um, and nothing else has worked um, when they've come uh, to see me and use this device um, they've received amazing results.